And then we're dashing around finding each other. I hit him a little bit with a thunderbolt. He tries to hit me with a, hit me with a shadow wave, but he misses. I kick him in the I kick him with a mega kick. And then he tries to mock punch me by dodging by going into a spin spin dash. And then I hit him with a spin dash. And then I give him a hyper beam. And he gives me a hyper beam similarly. Our hyper beams intercept into a courageous boom. And then we both end up in Manchester High School. In the gym. And he knocks me in there through, a, through the back entrance. And my head hits the wall. And it hurts. And I'm knocked unconscious for the moment. Meanwhile, Relnock approaches me. With the power of the crystal sunch ball in my, I have in my hand. I will deliver the final blow. <laughs> How befitting it is that I get to destroy you in the school where you felt most happy. With your gal pals and all that. Mostly with your gal pals. <sighs> too bad you won't be able to meet your fellow... You, too bad you won't be able to meet them, your fellow gal pal lancers, at the reunion. <laughs> Farewell, Christopher Christian Weston Chandler. Ooh. Then all of a sudden the basketball wishes in. <laughs> Ow. And it was hit him so hard, knocked him, and knocked him onto the floor, and it made his head crash against the uh, bleachers. And he's knocked unconscious. And then momentarily I awaken. Oh. Hey, Chris, are you okay? Please say something. Says Meg Chan, and she's over there. Meg, what happened? For a while you were not, you were unconscious. Magashi told me. Mugashi led me here, then w went back to Paradise I Island. Your hedgehogs were stored to damage from earlier. Hmm. Okay. What What of Relknock? Oh, the other guy? Yeah, don't get me started. It was just too weird. Oof. Anyway, he had his head on the bleachers, and he was still breathing, so he was sent to Quickville General Hospital. Oh, that jerk was about to finish me. How does his head meet the bleachers? Oh, I can answer that, old buddy. I meet the basketball star, Bionic the Hedgehog. Bionic, I haven't drawn you since 2004, when I made your Yu-Gi-Oh card. Hmm. I was shooting some hoops when I heard a crash. And st stunned and surprised, I watched as the green guy made his speech. When I heard what, the, what he was going to do, I threw my basketball with gusto, direct hit, and beyond. Not bad for a Lancer. Indeed, it was a while since you drew me, and before that was back in 1999, in that war against autism drawing. Still, it has been about ten years since I jumped out of that locker and met you. Oh yes, that was back in my freshman year. By the way, if you two met Bionic, this is Meg Chan, my gal pal. Meg is his science long lost but found basketball playing brother, Bionic the Hedgehog. Hello, it's nice to meet you. Hmm. I'm delighted to make your acquaintance, Meg. Meg. By the way, Christian, Sancho came by and explained all this to me. The other guy had it, so he dropped it, so I'm getting, but he dropped it, so I'm giving it to you. Oh, cool, thanks. Mm, speaking, of, speaking of that, yo, Rat, I've understood that uh, soon after you met him, you found a girlfriend for him. I could have had my pick among from among my fellow Lancers. Lanceresses. Hmm. But our genes just did not hook up well. Why don't you, can you help me out, Christian? Oh, gee, I'm sorry, Bionic, but back then I was na I was naive on dating and all that, so I just didn't think of it at the time. But if you need a sweetheart, Meg has created uh, quite a few foxy characters. If she's cool with it, you can go out with one of them. That's good. Thank you. Uh, shoot, 25 years old, and I still haven't even had my first date. Oh, well. Oh, well, at least I still have something to show of it. Hmm. Oh yeah, Christian, that DVD you told me about. I don't know about it, please tell me. Well, the master copy stays at home. A few copies will be generously shared with a few relatives, friends, and good old Providence Middle and Manchester High Schools. It is titled Christian Weston Chandler. Yep, I'm on TV. It'll feature my two new se my two news segments, my Mario Kart Lego movie filmed on Game Boy Camera, my Nintendo Power Worthy Animal Crossing documentary, a slideshow of photographs, arts, and comics projected from my PSP, a message for the future from me, and more. Also, there's an homage to my friends, teachers, family, and MHS's 1997 Bajri basketball team within the slideshow, all of whom were remembered from my heart as well as my yearbooks. This DVD will not be sold anywhere! 
until further notice from myself. That is a no-brainer. Still, Conta's head against the bleachers. Ugh, that had to hurt. Wonder if Rumlock will ever recover. Um, and if he does. Ten weeks later at the Quickville Hospital. Mm -hmm. uh, funky Monkey! Eh? Where am I? Mm, the last thing I remember was... <gasps> yeah, I was about to kill that straight goody twin of mine. When I was hit with a... When I hit with a basketball? Who in the world threw that? Mm, and then he's watching TV on... In, the, in sports news, Bionic Hedgehog won the game against Monroe High with a record blanking 130 baskets without overtime. And that's the Lancers. And the Lancers now heads the finals against uh, you. I w it was you. Right before passing out, I saw an orange guy in blue shoes. It was him, Bionic the Hedgehog. The end of this episode. Stay tuned for the next one. Thank you.